Hey guys, it's Cece here and I am just getting ready because I'm going on a little trip for the weekend. It's Saturday morning right now and I am going to Jeonju and Wonju for a like BTS tour, I guess. Um, <laughs> and I'm just like, who is BTS? <laughs> I know I'm terrible, but no, I like know who BTS is, obviously. How could I live in Korea without knowing? But I mean, I, and I like some of their songs, but I'm not like obsessed or anything. Like, obviously, like I know that they're a band, a K-pop band. You don't know K-pop? Like, I know K-pop. And I know that they make good music. Um, yeah, that's about it. <laughs> so this will be interesting, but I think we're just going to like some cafes a couple of restaurants and I'm just excited to meet some new people, get some cute pics at some cute cafes and like random places that BTS has been. I have no idea what I'm gonna wear. I'm a little, like the imposter syndrome is hitting me just a little bit because I don't feel like I am an influencer. <laughs> To like post on Instagram like I don't know and like I don't know <laughs> I'm just like I feel sort of weird it's gonna be a bunch of these like insta baddies and I'm just out here like wanna like so I the imposter syndrome is hitting me a little bit and I'm just trying to like get over that by talking to you aka myself because you're watching this video and I'm talking to myself <laughs> but it I don't know they obviously invited me they uh, they had my social medias and stuff so obviously they like my what I post and I sound so old they have my social medias you <laughs> like how old am I Ugh. but it's gonna be fine like the worst thing is they think I'm weird is that really is that really the worst thing I'm weird yes I am weird and that's okay <laughs> if that's what I'm afraid of brush that off right now you good girl you got this I think it's gonna be good. I can let that imposter syndrome go. Cause I'm not an imposter. I'm just me. Hi. And that's great. That's, that's all I gotta be. I don't gotta be anybody else. Girl, I don't even know how to be anybody else. I just gotta have fun. That's all that really matters, right? Am I having fun? Am I enjoying myself? And if not, then I don't ever have to do it again. <laughs> so. And that's like the worst case scenario. Honestly, it's gonna be fun. I'm gonna make new friends. I'm gonna try some good food, drink some good coffee and uh, just have new experiences. Like that's what I'm here to do. That's what I am doing. So it's, it's gonna be good. It's gonna be fun. Let that shit go. Let that shit go. Okay, well, I'm gonna finish getting ready and I will see you guys on the road.
our first stop was this restaurant that I will put the name of right here. And it was so good. It was just like traditional Korean food. It's really delicious soup and a bunch of good banchan and some beef. I tried it. It was it was okay, but not my thing. Um, and now we're at this really cute cafe. They have this little boat here that you can go in and go into the water. It's so cute. And then they have this little hanuk, like village type area that um, is like a traditional Korean building and or traditional Korean home building. I don't know. <laughs> I should know these things. This is why I'm here to learn about these things. And everyone here is really cool. Everyone is from a different country, which is so interesting and cool that we're all just like out here in Korea, just having a good time and doing, pursuing whatever we want. And it's really cool. It makes the world feel a little bit smaller and that everyone speaks all these different languages. And I'm like, girl, you need to learn another language. You can do it. I believe in you, okay? <laughs> So this is our second stop on our little BTS tour. We just look cute here, taking pictures, taking videos, and having a good time. I love it. So I'll see you guys soon. last stop for the day it's this cute little cafe and you can't really see the view but there's a nice view of this like railroad and I guess BTS took a cute little pic here and they have a bunch of teas and it has just been a really fun day we went to the um, Hanuk village and got some fun pictures there I guess BTS stayed there once. 안녕하세요. You know what my question is? How do they have time to go to all these places? There's these BTS locations all around Korea. How do they have time to go all around Korea? Like, aren't they busy? Don't they like make music and videos and stuff like that? <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. But yeah, it's been a super fun day. I'm pretty hungry now. I'm real excited for dinner. And then we're checking into the hotel and then we got a whole nother day tomorrow. So it's been a great day. Such a good day. We had so much fun just cafe hopping and eating some good food, laughing a lot, and 
just taking a bunch of fun pictures and having a good time. It was for my first trip. This has been absolutely fantastic. I'm really excited for tomorrow. I think I'm gonna dress up in a hanbok or at the Jeonju Hanuk village. I'm so excited. I've wanted to do this since I've got here. It was just too hot at first and now it might be a little cold, but I think it'll be okay. And I'm so excited. <laughs> it's gonna be so good. Good morning. We just had breakfast and drove over to the Hanuk village in Jeonju. So it's right behind me. You can see all the Hanuks. Something Korean, something traditional. You know, we love it. We love it. It's beautiful. It's very unique and it's really cute. I love it. We're just at this cafe right now with this great view and we have about two hours to go exploring and maybe try on a humbug and just have fun in this cute little Hanuk village. Let's go. <laughs> I love it so much. I literally feel like a princess in this beautiful dress. We had so much fun getting ready and now we're just gonna go walk around. And I just I'm living my little princess fantasy out here today. And luckily it's not too cold outside so we can just be cute. Oop. Oops, tripped. <laughs> So happy, so full, and so sleepy, but we have one more stop. We are now at the Jeonju Korean Traditional Liquor Museum, and we are gonna make some liquor, or wine, or makgeolli, or something, and then we get to take it home and drink it. this video by saying I am so grateful for this trip I it's funny watching that video that I made right before leaving and it was just a couple days ago because literally all the anxiety all the imposter syndrome feeling that I was having literally just went 
away the moment that I got there and met everybody and everybody was so kind and so much fun and now I have a bunch of new friends that I can't wait to see again. I'm just so happy and so grateful and so my cup is just so full and I can't wait to go on the next trip so I will see you guys next time and have a good week. I love you all. Thank you for watching.